Um, this... Seems like it requires a lot of wall running, so I'll avoid that. So does this. Oh, that ain't good. Okay. Let's go, BD1. Boom. There you go. I need to avoid that creature. Oh. Ah! <laughs> well, oops. Okay. Did not mean to do that. <laughs> that was easy. There you go. There you go. This is where I was meant to come. Oh. I thought I saw one down here. Okay, boom. Parfish. Okay. What are you looking for? Oh. Oh, wait. Okay. If I scanned it, I, I figured there was something I could do with it, but I guess that's wrong. See something in there? Well, apparently. It can detect force things, too. Try again. It's difficult, Master. Yes, the path is difficult. It may seem impossible, but with persistence and the force as your ally, you will overcome any obstacle. You will master any path. Now, do what you must to reach me. Focus. Faster, more intensity. Now, reach my position. Yay, I can persistence and the force is my ally. Just remembering old tricks. Okay, I need to hop back up here.
Awesome. This opens up some paths to me. Yay! That unlocks that. Unexplored. And blocked. Yes. Okay, hop up here. Okay. I need to get up there. I'll find a way. Where are you going? <laughs> Now, new lightsaber switch required. Valor and wisdom, too. Shortcut unlocked. <laughs> Boom, there you go. Another chest. New poncho material. <laughs> Yay, new poncho. Okay. It works. Check the map. Okay, seems like to my left. No! No! <laughs> this is harder than it looks. Ooh, there you go. And there it is. Are you see there? Oh, it's on. Oh, you waiting up for me. We're not finished yet. <laughs> okay, okay, he probably would have won. Probably. Yeah, he definitely would have won. He was way faster than me. I opened the door. This structure has been here for a long time. Amazing. 
Yeah, that is amazing, actually. This is awesome. You all right, BD? Well done, whoever you are. You have passed the test I left behind and gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Eno Cordova. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place, this vault, is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the Force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron containing a list of the names and locations of young Force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but... So that's the Jedi Order, a be re I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the Force as the Zephyr once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zephyr homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. <laughs> His mind is blown. I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. Oh yeah, sit in water. You know, I've been alone for a while now. Without any purpose, just hiding. There's no way to live. Not for a Jedi. Or a droid. Maybe Seer was right. Maybe we're done hiding. Hey. You want to meet some, uh, friends of mine? Let's do this. Zephyr. Use the holo tape on the mantis. Yep, meditate. I will rest a little bit. Boom, there you go. Enemies have been respawned, so I think I found what you wanted me to see. Sounds like you did. We'll be waiting. Wee <laughs> Oh I'm gonna need to oh the red attacks can't be blocked I can block his other attacks maybe I should actually try blocking Oh, that gives you kind of boost. Oh, ow.
now. Stim. No. I almost had him beat. I was doing pretty good. A Jedi doesn't go seeking conflict just because he can. Oh, yep, scan. I'll check it out. Whoa, look at you. You are huge. What is this? My friend, it appears the Cepho had some interest in death up here. It's strange for such a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. That would mean there is something. There was something interesting there. Scanning again? Faded mural. Ah, uh, shortcut unlocked. It seems like a good should be a lot quicker than the way in. <laughs> okay, this seems yeah, this is definitely a lot quicker. Yay. Oh, God, hole. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> They're so adorable. Look at those creatures. Another one? Find something? Boggling tunnel. Oh, BB1, I can give you a paint job. I'll make you more red. And the mantis. Yes, that will be red too. There you go. <laughs> oh, that is the landing gear that <laughs> I was trying to um, 
enter the ship through the landing here. That doesn't work. Oh, it was auto walking. Yes, I did. Knew about BD1. Come on board. We'll talk inside. <laughs> oh, BD1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? <laughs> get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! Go! Get out of there! Get out! That is BD1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of petroleum beam fabric? Not really. Oh. I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Grease. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of Force-sensitive children. <sighs> the next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A holo what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Use the Force. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. With that list of Force Sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it! Well, except the Holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zeppo homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look, before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Are you with us? <clears throat> We're in. Dathomir is Zepho. It's your choice. I definitely want to check out Dathmir because that is interesting. But I'm gonna do the Zepho first. But before that, hey Grease, what's this thing? What? You've never seen a terrarium before? Sure, but don't they usually have plants in them? Well, I've been a bit busy hauling you around the galaxy. <laughs> but you know, you could pay me back with some seeds. I thought you hated nature. When it's out there, you betcha. But when it's behind a comfortably thick wall of embarn glass, that's perfection. All right, I'll see if I can find any. Basically, he wants nature away from him where he can still look at it. Yep, there you go. Save. Awesome. And now I can customize my lightsaber here. Emitter. There you go. I'll use that. Oh, yeah, that looks good. Carefully wave that thing. Yeah, I'll hop back in here just to kind of save again. There you go. And that will be all for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay positive, And I will see you guys next time. God bless you guys.
See ya.